guys, it's Lori. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new here. Today, FabFitFun has released winter spoilers for ca categories number six, five, and four. This video is going to be category six and five, and then I will do a separate video showcasing category four. I don't know why I'm doing it that way. It just, they used to do five and six were the only things that seasonals could not customize. So those were like separate spoilers. Categories four through one through four, everyone could customize. Now you can customize all categories, but for some reason I'm just gonna do five and six together. I don't wanna do all three in one video. I also don't wanna film three separate videos today. So you're gonna get five and six in this video and four in a separate video in a little while here. So I am super excited for spoiler time. This is my favorite time. Well, I was gonna say of the year, but of the season, I guess, four times a year. Uh, I do all of the spoiler videos, recaps and all that stuff. So if you love FabFitFun and love spoilers, definitely stick around, subscribe to my channel if you're not, and hit that notification bell so that you are notified when I upload new videos. So let's get into customization six first, and then I will do number five. Uh, we don't know additional choice prices. Sometimes they keep them the same, sometimes they raise them. So I'm not even going to talk about additional choice uh, like prices yet, but if you're not familiar with FabFitFun, you choose one item for each category that's included in your box price, and then you can add on additional items in each category for additional costs. Okay, let's get into the spoilers though, because there's a lot to go through here. All right, here is the first spoiler for category number six. This is the Lisa Says Ga Wine Tote in Black Ivory or Black Ivory Cow, I guess is the name of the pattern. This is a $55 value. It says, don't show up to the party empty-handed this holiday season. Easily carry your essentials, aka your favorite wine, with you in this adorable wine tote. Uh, the size of this is 11 inches by 6.25 inches. Care instructions, mach machine wash cold, gentle cycle, line dry, do not bleach, and warm iron if required. This is 100% cotton and it's female founded with no shipping restrictions. I think this is super cute if you are giving wine as a gift. It would honestly be a really great black elephant, or not black elephant, white elephant gift. Uh, super fun. Definitely an easy pass for me. It's not anything that I'm like dying to have, but it's fun to see different interesting items in this box. Okay, here is the second item in category number six. This is the Fenty Skin Cookies and Clean Whipped Clay Pore Detox Face Mask with Salicylic Acid and Charcoal. This has a $37 value says Fenty Skin continues to do, no, to do no wrong when it comes to top tier skincare must-haves. And this poor detox has found a permanent spot in our routine. Key ingredients of whipped clay and charcoal clear dirt and purify pores, leaving you with smoother looking skin. This is cruelty-free, vegan, gluten-free, fragrance-free, non-comedogenic, and microbead-free. The size of this is 75 milliliters or 2.5 ounces. Uh, and you put this on an even layer on clean, wet, or dry skin. Massage into skin to let the encapsulated charcoal in... Wait. To mix in the encapsulated charcoal into the clay. Uh, letting the mask transform from white to gray. Oh, that's interesting. So the mask will go from white to gray. And then when it's fully gray, leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and then rinse. And it says you can use it two to three times a week but non-consecutive days. This is female founded and BIPOC founded with no shipping restrictions. I really like seeing uh, some new Fenty products in this box. I honestly have several clay masks and I probably remember to use a clay mask like once or twice a year. So I have, you know, a lifetime of clay masks. So I definitely don't need this, but I think it's a great option if you are looking for a new clay mask. Okay. Here is the next item in category number six. These are the Sweaty Betty Varsity Slogan Socks. Size, oh, and it comes in two different sizes. Size four to seven and size eight to 10. This has a $24 value. Cozy Season just got even more comfortable with these classic and cute varsity socks. Add in some cozy sweats, a cup of hot chocolate, and your fave movie, and you'll have all the makings for the perfect night in. Care instructions, wash and warm, unreduced spin, do not bleach, do not dry clean. There's 74% organic cotton, 23% polyester, and 3% elastine. This is female founded and there are no shipping restrictions. I don't know. These are just like socks, but I definitely have to pick these. They're super cute. I love the gray. I love the varsity stripes on them. 
There's just something about these socks that I need in my winter box. I don't know why. I mean, it helps that there's nothing else in this category that is like screaming my name that I have to have. But I love these socks and they look super cozy and I just definitely feel like I need them in my winter box. Okay. I'm sorry, I've got a cold going on here. So if my voice is crazy or like the sniffing bothers you, I'm really sorry. Hopefully I don't cough during this video, but just gotta apologize in advance. I'm dealing with a cold here. Okay, the next item is by Rosie Jane, Chill the F Out Everyday Body Milk. It has a $28 value. And it says you can never have too many skin nourishing products in your lineup during winter. And this body milk is topping our list of can't live without skincare sav saviors. By combining the skin tightening effects of a toner, the hydrating aspects of a moisturizing cream, <clears throat> and soothing aloe vera, your skin will thrive no matter the weather. This is vegan and cruelty free. The size is 148 milliliters or five ounces. And it just says apply generously directly onto skin or into palm, massage all over body and repeat as needed. This is female founded with no shipping restrictions. So far there's been no shipping restrictions, which has been great. Although I do know some are coming, but that's a great option. I don't need any body lotion, trying to be really good. I tried and actually was successful with the fall box to be really good. I had a little bit of FOMO, but so far I did not cave and get a second box. So I'm gonna try to be really good. I don't need any lotion. So that's an easy like cross that off my list. Okay, here is the next item in category six and what I'm a little bit confused about, I'll tell you why. So it says it's the Tower 28 Juice Balm Lip Balm Bundle in mix and shake has a $32 value. So the picture shows two different shades, mix and shake. Also, it shows two little, like I assume it's zippered like makeup bags that these come in. So I don't know if the bundle is saying you get a lippy and a bag, or if it's saying you get both lippies. I can't imagine that their bundle is both lippies and both makeup bags, but for some reason, there's a picture of the makeup bag on here as well. So. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that what they really mean is you're getting one lippy and one makeup bag and you pick the colors. It does say and, but with FabFitFun you never know. So it's, they're saying lip balm bundle in mix and shake. So it's possible that it's both, but it just doesn't make sense they would have two lippies and two bags. So we will see as the time gets closer. I haven't seen that question answered yet on the forums, but I'm not, so I'm not 100% sure, but that's just my guess that it's probably not two lippies in two bags, but I could be wrong. Okay, so it says this customization lip combo will have you looking like, <clears throat> sorry, my throat, look, looking like the star of your own holiday movie. And these lip balms will be the star of your get ready with me routine. They're vegan, buttery soft, and give the perfect pop of color while nurturing your lips with mango seed oil, vitamin E, and vitamin C. The size is 0 0.09 fluid ounces or 2.7 milliliters. Um, just says to use, swipe and smile, apply over bare lips or pair with your favorite lip liner. They're female founded and BIPOC founded with no shipping restrictions. Also, they have like a link to the product page and it just lists a single lippy. So, and I've not seen that bag anywhere in, like I didn't see the bag on their website. So we'll see, I guess time will tell with that one. Okay, here is the next item in customization number six. Playground Mood Maker Body and Massage Oil. This is a $32 value. And it says, with adaptogens, botanical, and plant oils designed to boost your mind, your mood, soothe your skin, and ease muscle tension. This is a quick and easy way to awaken your libido and spark your senses. This is vegan. The size is four ounces. And it says, how to use massage a generous amount onto dry or damp skin. It is female founded. And this is our first shipping restriction. This is for US only. Okay, here is the next item in customization number six. This is the Verb Products Hydrate Oil. This has a $20 value and it says, protect, smooth, and hydrate your locks with this hair oil. Powered by key ingredients that include argon oil, bapsu oil, argon oil and bap b bapsu oil. I've never heard of that oil. Uh, hot styling tools are no match for this hair care must have as it protects your strands up to 450 degrees. So this is dr for dry and frizzy hair. The scent is amber and warm jasmine. It's vegan, cruelty-free, paraben-free, gluten-free, and no harmful sulfates. It's two ounces or 60 milliliters. And it says to use, apply two to three pumps to dry or damp hair. I read that backwards, but it's the same thing. It said damp or dry, but I 
reversed it. Um, it can be used with or without heat styling and there are no shipping restrictions on this item. Okay, here's the next item in the box for category number six. It's the Rejuva, Rejuvia Sleep Spray. This has a $45 value. When I first saw this, I just assumed it was like every other sleep spray like we've seen uh, have been in the box, like lavender spray. You put on your pillow, you put on your wrist or something, but this is completely different. I was actually shocked when I looked a little bit more into this. Um, I'll tell you in just a second. So it says, you'll never miss out on your beauty rest when you use the Rejuvia Sleep Spray before bed. It's an oral sleep spray designed to help you sleep through the night and have you wake up feeling refreshed and ready to take on the day. I missed that even when I was looking at it. So it's non-GMO, vegan, and mint flavored. It's 0.47 ounces or 14 milliliters. How to use. Uh, spray six to eight times under your tongue or on the inside of your cheek, 15 to 20 minutes before bed, and then swallow. Our sleep spray has a delicious mint flavoring to it, and each spray bottle will last you about 30 to 35 days. I thought that was super interesting. I've never seen a sleep spray like that that you put in your mouth. So I'm not sure if I'm going to try this out or not. Uh, it does seem interesting. So yeah, it may be something that I try. Uh, it's female founded and this is restricted to the U.S. only. <clears throat> I was kind of looking at it and it has melatonin. Um, I was looking on the website here. Let's just go to the website. That's going to be easier. I think that's where I found the list of. So it has melatonin, hemp, L-arginine, L-oranthine, and 5-hydroxy tripofan. I'm not sure and organic hemp seed oil. It's definitely an interesting um, option. I've honestly never heard of sleep spray that you spray under your tongue or inside on the sides of your cheek. Definitely interesting. Okay, and how much was that? $45 value. Okay, very interesting. All right, and here is the next item in customization number six. This is the Haps Eau de Toilette uh, spray. I guess it's just Eau de Toilette, sorry. It has a $25 value. Just spray before you go and let this room fragrance do the rest. It eliminates odors and keeps the area smelling fresh. This is two fluid ounces um, and you spray it into your toilet before you use the toilet. So it's a lot like the poopery that has been in like every FabFitFun sale imaginable. Uh, warnings avoid on eye contact and do not ingest. Maybe they had to put that after the like sleep spray that you spray in your mouth. They were like, don't spray this inside of you. Um, okay, use it in a well ven ventilated area. Not sure that most bathrooms are well ventilated, but okay. Uh, the notes of this are grapefruit, bergamot, and rose. Those are the top notes. The middle notes are green floral, suede, and oak moss. And the bottom notes are musk, vanilla, and amber. There are no shipping restrictions on that item. Okay, we've got one last item in customization number six. This is the Milan and Goats Acne Treatment Nighttime. It says it has a $26 value and it says, let this treatment work hard while you get your rest. This product synthesizes 10% active sulfur and salicylic, salicylic acid. I don't know why that was hard to treat blemishes while calming your skin with camphor. The addition of zinc oxide helps prevent signs of scarring. So this is 14 milliliters or half an fluid ounce and how to use do not shake after cleansing skin, apply white sulfur sediment with cotton swab directly onto blemish at bedtime. As an overnight treatment, limit to one application daily to avoid drying out skin. The active ingredient is sulfur 10%. <clears throat> uh, there are no, or no. Okay, there's shipping restriction. It is US and Canada only. This seems like it's like, uh, I want to say Kate Spade, but that is not it. Uh, I can't think of the brand. I've gotten it a couple different times from my daughters in my Ipsy. Kate something. Why can I not think of it? I have no idea. My brain cannot think of it. It's a pink, like a glass bottle with pink in it and you dip a Q-tip into it and then you put it directly on the acne. So basically I've never used this product, but we have used this other brand that I cannot think of for like Kate Somerville, right? That's it. Kate Somerville. Um, I'm pretty sure there's a few other brands. I think I've tried actually a couple of them. It's a pretty decent product. My kids prefer the little like acne stickers. Teenagers today like just put them all over their face and wear them that way. I don't know. Um, but that's an interesting option. So those are all of the customizations for category number six. Uh, for me, 
I'm pretty sure that all I'm picking is the socks. There's a couple other things that are interesting, but if I'm trying to be really good, this is a category I feel like I can be good in and just pick these socks pretty easily. So now we're gonna get into customization number five. Although it looks like I thought I was at the top of the page and I'm not. Okay, customization number five. Here is the first item for number five. This is the Neighborhoods Set of Three Sponge Cloths and it's in the Fresh Herb pattern. This has an $18 value and it says, you'll keep your home and the environment clean with these eco-friendly replacements for cleaning cloths. From washing dishes to wiping windows, these quick drying cloths are safe and effective choice holding up to 15 times their weight in water. The size of them is 6.8 inches by 7.75 inches each. Uh, care instructions, rinse underwater. They're wood, cellulose, 70% and 30% cotton. They're female founded and there are no shipping restrictions. I did look into these a little bit. It says they are biodegradable. They will last a couple months and then they'll start to biodegrade and then you could just throw them away or put them in your compost pile. So. It's not something that you're going to have for years and years. It also said a lot of times you can just rinse them underwater, but if every once in a while you want to run them through your dishwasher or the wash machine to clean them. So it's an interesting option. I am definitely, they're on my radar. I'm semi interested in that just because I've never used something like that before. Okay, here is the next item in customization number five. This is a Saturday Skin Scalp Plus Hair Strengthening Peptide Treatment. This has a $19 value, and it says this non-greasy hair treatment delivers nutrients and an energetic buzz to your scalp. Thanks to the mix of 15 proprietary peptides and caffeine that revitalizes your scalp and promotes hair cell growth. This non-greasy hair treatment delivers nutrients and an energetic buzz to your scalp. Thanks to the mix of 15 proprietary peptides and caffeine. Wow, that was like another... I swear they... Yeah, they have that like same text twice on here. So I... You got to hear me try to read that twice. Okay, the size of this. 80 milliliters, 2.7 fluid ounces. Uh, how to use best use a clean, dry scalp or towel dried after shampooing. Shake bottle before application. Apply a few drops or as needed once daily, ideally in the evening. Massage into scalp thoroughly. This is a leave-on treatment. Do not wash off ap after application. This is female founded and there are no shipping restrictions. I just don't use this type of product. I shower in the mornings. I just don't want like oil or anything greasy sitting on my hair all night. So this isn't something, or on my scalp, this isn't something that I'll probably try, but I know a lot of people like this brand and like trying different hair products in the box. <clears throat> okay, here's the next item in customization number five. This is the Kira Moon Reset Roller. This has a $24 value, and it says this reset roller is a must for any self-care routine. It stimulates circulation to help reduce puffiness and muscle tension while relieving glowing and healthier looking skin. Pro tip, combine your fave serums or moisturizers to improve product absorption and take your skincare, skincare routine to the next level. Um... Okay, so the size of this, this isn't really gonna like help us a whole lot. 2.25 inches, I'm gonna guess how wide the roller is, by 2.5 inches, by 6.75 inches. Uh, okay, how to use, apply pressure, gentle pressure and roll in sweeping motions along forehead, face contours, jaw and neck. You may use the roller with your favorite serums or creams to aid in product, product absorption, clean with rubbing alcohol, I can't talk rubbing alcohol or gentle soap and water. Uh, this is silicone based and female founded with no shipping restrictions. I'm going to be honest with you. I have like several jade rollers and I even got like the cryo roller. I think it was in a box last year. I never use that stuff. Like when I'm doing my skincare routine, it's like put all the steps on my face, get everything put on my face and go. So I, this is not something that I'm going to get. I know that if I had this, I would probably use it like one or two times, which I have my other, like the jade roller that I have and the like, I don't know if it's called a cryo roller, but it's like that metal that's cold. Uh, I'll use it like a couple times and then it will sit in my skincare like bin and it will just like sit there and not be used. So this is an easy like cross off my list. I know a lot of people like this type of thing, but I'm not someone who's going to sit there and like use a face roller on myself. Like it just, I don't have time for that. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I scrolled too far. Here's the next item in customization number five. It's the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream, two ounces in vanilla. This has an $18 value. 
It says, get ahead of winter dryness with this ultra repair cream in delicious vanilla scent. Deliver ultimate hydration with this fast absorbing top tier cream that protects your skin thanks to key ingredients such as colloidal oatmeal. This cream is so effective, it can even help treat eczema and improve your skin barrier. Uh, this is two ounces. Apply as needed, day and night, to instantly revive dry distress. I can't talk, guys. I'm sorry. Dry distressed skin on your face and body. Um, active ingredient is colloidal oatmeal of 0.5%. Female founded with no shipping restrictions. Okay, this... I don't know. Something bothers me about this. I think because it's like a multi-purpose cream, it says use it on your face or your body, but then it's like vanilla scented. So it seems like it should be a body cream, but they're saying you can put it on your face. I'm not sure. And then it's only two ounces, which seems like that would be the size for a skincare of your face product. So I don't know. I'm not like somebody who wants to put the same lotion on my face that you put on your body. It seems weird. Maybe that's just me, but something about that bothers me. If it's a body lotion or hand lotion, it should be much bigger than two ounces. And if it's a face lotion, it shouldn't be vanilla scented. So I don't know. Um, I do like first aid beauty, but I think I'm going to pass on that one just because I feel like it's trying to do too many things. And I don't know that I like that. Okay. Here's the next item in customization. Number five, it's the Wander Beauty Good to Go Beauty Sponge Ornament Kit. This has a $20 value. This beauty sponge ornament will be the highlight of your makeup loving friends stocking this holiday season. It comes complete with two makeup sponges, two triangle powder puffs, and a silicone brush cleansing pad. And um, yeah, it just tells you how to use the different things. I'm not going to go over that. I have a bunch of like beauty blender makeup sponges. I don't use them. I use brushes like even for my foundation to put on. I'm kind of tempted by those triangle powder puffs, but honestly, I've seen a lot of things like that at TJ Maxx on the end caps. I'm sure I can get one for a couple of dollars to try out, so I probably won't waste a choice on this, but it seems like a great idea. Honestly, it seems like a great gift idea. The fact that it's in a little ornament container is pretty cute. Uh, this is female founded and BIPOC founded with no shipping restrictions. Okay, and here is the next item in customization number five. I don't like that we're seeing a lot of retail values like $18. I don't like that that because this category number five it's not going to be a whole lot less than the product value so that kind of is starting to bother me a little bit but anyways the item is the We Wore What bow clip this has an $18 value it says the perfect hair accessory doesn't exist just kidding it totally does this adorable bow clip will be the focal point of all your OOTD videos this season and for good reason. Plus, with the bow's raw edge, you're able to personalize your look and cut the bow to your desired length. The size of this is 12 inches by 7 inches wide by 2 inches. I'm assuming that's how much it sticks off your head. That can't be right, but that's what it looks like it's saying. Um, how to use clip onto hair. The materials are polyester and metal. This is female founded with no shipping restrictions. And I've got to say, I asked my teenage daughters, I said, can a 46 year old woman wear a hair bow like this? And they're like, yeah, no, I think that would be totally cute. So I don't know. I think it's cute. I have long enough hair that I think I could pull it off. I'm just not sure if I could like wear a bow in the back of my hair like that and not feel like I was trying to look like a teenager. So let me know. Should I get a bow to wear in my hair? Could I pull that off? Or should I just stay away from that option? There's plenty of other things in this category that I could pick. Okay. <clears throat> Here's the next item in customization number five. This is the Fly by Jing Szechuan Chili Crisp. This is a six ounce jar with a $15 value. We're getting even lower value here. Uh, Tis the season to spice up your favorite go-to meals with this delicious chili sauce. From wings to noodles, you'll impress your guests, your family, and yourself with all of the tasty recipes you'll be whipping up. This is six ounces and it says how to use drizzle on top of pizza, tacos, burritos, barbecue, noodles, dumplings, rice bowls, and even ice cream. The ingredients, wraps non-GMO rapeseed oil, non-GMO soybean oil, dried chili pepper, preserved black bean, garlic, sesame oil, salt, shallots, ginger, mushroom powder, Szechuan pepper, seaweed powder, and spices. This is female founded and it is shipping restricted to the US only. So this item looks really cool. I'm always interested when they try a new category, like a new item, type of item, I guess I should say, in our box. So I looked at the website. I was really tempted by this at first. 
I don't love spicy food, but several of my kids do. But I have a couple different things to say. One, I was reading the reviews on this because I wanted to see just how spicy this actually was. And I think it's spicy, but not super spicy because there is like an extra spicy version of this exact sauce that you can get if you're looking for extra spicy. But some of the reviews said that this jar leaked when it was shipping to them. And so their reviews were negative saying it leaked and couldn't use it. Can you picture this leaking in your FabFitFun box? To me, that would be like the ultimate terrible thing. I like would cry if I open my box and my unhide blanket that I'm dying to get, my emerald unhide blanket smells like chili crisp. I would not like that. And I cannot imagine that would wash out very well. So for that reason alone, the thought of this leaking, it's an oil, like chili sauce, but it's in an oil. There's the first two ingredients are oils. I am not risking this leaking or breaking in transit and being all over my box. That would be terrible. So for that reason alone, this is for sure not going in my box. I have some of the reviews that you can buy this like at Walmart or other grocery stores. So if this is something that you really want, you can pick it up much safer at the grocery store and save something else for your FabFitFun category five choice. That's my two cents. Risk it if you want to. I'm just not going to risk having my unhide blanket and anything else in my box having chili oil all over it. Okay, here is the next item in customization number five. This is the Ahava Mineral Radiance Cleansing Gel. This has a $28 value and it says your skincare routine just got a major upgrade. Wave goodbye to impurities and hello to radiant glowing skin with this cleansing gel. It's gentle, hydrating, and non-drying making it the perfect everyday go-to for fresh, clean, and rejuvenated skin. This is vegan, alcohol-free, GMO-free, paraben-free, pregnancy-safe, SLS, SLES free. This is, the size of this is 3.4 fluid ounces or 100 milliliters. Uh, massage into wet face, avoiding the eye area. Rinse off with lukewarm water. This is female-founded with no shipping restrictions. I am kind of tempted by this. I don't need another face wash, but... I've really liked the Ahava products that I've tried and the cleansing gel sounds amazing. So I don't know, this could find its way into my box, but we will see. It's definitely on my like short list of things to research a little bit more. Okay, and this is the last item in customization number five, right here. This is the Jade Leaf Strawberry Matcha Latte Packet times two. So it sounds like we get two packets here and it has a 28 $21.82 value. Uh, it says, this is some tea you won't want to spill. Become your own barista with this cafe style, hot or iced matcha mix with a delicious strawberry twist. This lightly sweetened matcha powder contains pure organic Japanese matcha, organic cane sugar, and natural flavors to give you a morning or afternoon pick-me-up. This is vegan. I can't talk, guys. I'm so sorry. Vegan, cruelty-free, and dairy-free. The size is 2.5 ounces. So 2.5 ounces in each packet, so you're getting a total of 5 ounces. Um, how to use, just add 2 teaspoons of strawberry matcha mi latte mix with a quarter cup of warm water. When mixed, combine with your favorite hot or cold milk and enjoy. For a true cafe experience, froth your milk first. Um, there's no shipping restrictions on this item. I like matcha, but I really don't drink matcha very often. I am a coffee girl through and through. I have coffee twice a day. My kids, on the other hand, like matcha, and something about strawberry matcha just sounds really good. I might be tempted by this. This could be just a fun, like, holiday drink to have on hand. So, yeah, those are all of the Category 5 and 6 customization spoilers. What do you guys think of these spoilers? What are you picking? I feel like these are pretty decent categories. There's nothing, like, jumping out, like, for this category that I have to have. For some reason, for customization number six, the socks are jumping out that I have to have them. But I feel like I can pick easily. Like I'll be able to find something in each category that I like and will make a great box item. But there's nothing like I don't have to stock up on like five items in this category, which is really good because right now I am in trouble with the early spoilers of customization number one. So if I can like be good in these last categories, that will help my budget a lot. So Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this video. I'm going to be filming here in just a few minutes uh, the customization number four video, so be sure and check out that video soon. And as always, guys, thanks for watching and have a great day.